Here we have uh, a city math question. Let's go the information. The function f is defined by f of x equals to three to the x to the power. The function g is an increasing linear function. Uh, in the x-y plane, the graphs of y equals to f of x and y equals to g of x intersect uh, at two points, a comma j and b comma k, where uh, g is j is less than k. When uh, g of x is greater than f of x, which of the following must be true? Okay, since it's uh, digital density, uh, we can go to Desmos graphing calculator and sketch the graph of the function that is y equals to three to the x to the power. So I replace f of x by y because it is given that y equals f of x. So in mathematics, whenever we have f of x or g of x, it represents y coordinate. So we can write this function y equals to three to the x to the power. Okay, now let's go to Desmos graphing calculator to sketch the graph of uh, this exponential function that's what, that is y equals to three to the x to the power. Here we have Desmos graphing calculator. Okay, so in this x y plane, I have to sketch the graph of the exponential function y is equal to 3 to the x to the power. So I have to give the function y equals to 3 to the x to the power as input over here on the left side uh, top corner y equals to 3 to the x to the power. Okay, now I got the graph of uh, the exponential function y equals to 3 to the x to the power. And uh, so the graph of this exponential function y equals to 3 to the x to the power intersects x axis at uh, one because when I plug in x equals to zero, y equals one. And when I plug in x equals one, I'm getting uh, one comma three and also two comma nine in this, I'm getting the points over here. Okay, so now I know how the graph of uh, the function y equals to three to the x to the power. Okay, now uh, let me sketch the same graph uh, along uh, with the question and then solve the problem. Okay, let's go to the original question. Here we have the graph of uh, the exponential function that is f of x equals to three to the x to the power. Okay, now we have to sketch the graph of the function g. And also the question says g is an increasing linear function. Linear function means uh, its graph will be a straight line. Le uh, linear, increasing linear function means it will be a raising line. That is uh, from when you look at the line from left side to right side, it has to go up. So then only uh, the, its function. So the function which represents a line will be an increasing linear function. And also uh, the graph of f of x and the graph of g of x uh, will intersect at two points, a comma j and b comma k. Okay, now uh, let me draw a raising line uh, which represents a graph of the uh, function, linear function uh, g. So let me sketch it. Okay, I've sketched uh, the green color line uh, represents a graph of the function g. It's an li increasing linear function and it intersects, uh, I mean, the graph of f of x and the graph of g of x. This is graph of g of x. Okay, so the graph of f of x and g of x intersects at two points. So this is the first point and the first point is a comma j and uh, this is the second point. The second point is uh, b comma k and also we have to make sure that the value of j has to be less than k. So here uh, j is the y coordinate of the first point and k is the y coordinate of the second point b comma k. So I'm pretty sure also uh, here the y value is uh, less than the y value we have over here because uh, so here the y coordinate is j and here uh, I mean at this point the y coordinate is k. So definitely J is uh, less than K. Okay, so this condition is satisfied. Okay, now, uh, so we have to uh, find uh, uh, the statement which is true in the given answer choices uh, with the condition that is G of X has to be greater than F of X. So already we know that G of X is nothing but the Y coordinate of the linear function uh, and uh, F of X is the Y coordinate of the exponential function. Okay, so the Y value on, on the graph of the G of X has to be greater than the Y value on the graph of the F of X. Okay, just consider and also let's mark the x coordinate over here. This is a point a comma j. So x coordinate uh, over here is a. And uh, at this point, the x coordinate is b. So the uh, x coordinate over here is b. Okay, between a and b. So the graph of the linear function, the, the straight line is above the graph of the exponential function, the green color part. So if, it, if x takes a value between a and b, so the g of x, f of g of x is above the graph of the f of x. So if I consider any point uh, between a and b, so the value of the y coordinate will be greater than the, um, the value of y coordinate of the function g of x will be greater than the value of the y coordinate f of x. So when x takes a value between a and b, so g of x, that is y coordinate of the function g of x linear function is greater than the y coordinate of the exponential function f of x that is clearly uh, seen in the graph. So the correct answer choice for this question is option D. That is when A takes, when X takes a value between A and B. So F, G of X is greater than F of X. So the correct answer choice for this question is option D.